What's up, brother? What's up, bro? How you doing? Two more, so. This one and then another two? No, so. No, this one and one more. After. And his opponent. From the shoot right here in Bakersfield, California, give it up for Herman Saboda. Another representative of the shoot MMA, it's Brian Travers' team, great coaching team here. I didn't get a chance to talk to either of these two fighters. Uh, oh, you know what? I did see... Uh, him, him training in the back, but again, some of these guys weren't fully, fully ready to go with hand wraps and their shin guards. So sometimes back there, you don't know who's fighting or who's like supporting or a trainer. Well, especially these guys are fighting so late, you don't want to start warming oh, up yeah. that early in the day. You're gonna blow your tank. Yeah, there's no, there's no point. Arturo fighting out and of Checkmat Northridge. Checkmat has a prestigious jiu-jitsu background. Um, so if this goes to the ground, we may see some uh, technical mastery. Jermaine here, though, loves to throw down. Super exciting fighter to watch. Once again, coming out of Brian Travers' gym. Such a talented coaching staff. So this one should be fun to watch. Let's, uh, let's see how this one plays out. They both look ready. Oh, he no did not want to touch gloves. Oh, oh missed well, that right he hook. might want to wish he touched him, like you said earlier. Arturo quick on the takedown. Good knee to the body. Come on. Watch your neck. Quick single. Lock in, big slam. Oh, good slam by German. Arturo having great patience, keeping the head stuff, trying to get back to a guard. He closes his half guard. I don't feel like closing half guard is the solution right here because no. German obviously has great pressure, great head He's positioning. Good punches from the top. Good, let's pass under hook. Shift to the Good, Arturo getting his head to the mat, working past that half guard, keeping great chest contact, striking as he can. Arturo here trying to play too much of a jiu-jitsu game. He needs to get some separation. He initiated this takedown. Now he's on the now he's at the bottom end of it. Yeah. And German is I, I, want, I would like to see him do more to get out of this too. Forty-five seconds. Let's pass. He's defending him passing and getting full mount really well. But German passed the half guard. He's just holding that guillotine, but because he's inside mount, nothing's gonna happen with it. Neon belly to step over there. There we go. Good, good technique there. Let's posture up and pound. Oh, and here, good and ground and pound. Here's where the work starts. He needs to get those hooks in. They got him in. Let's see German just pummel. Oh man. Let's cook him before the round's over. We got 10 seconds to hit. Oh, oh he went for a rear naked. Rear naked. It's under the chin. Nope. A little bit of rolling around. Good exchange the right there. Yeah. Good job from German staying composed. Nice deep breaths right at the end of the round. He, he doesn't look like he's winded or gassed. That's a good round to end with. Sounds like German has a lot of fans. He's got a cheering section right now going wild for him. If I'm Arturo's corner, I'm telling him to... Uh, if he's going to initiate a takedown, he needs to come out on top. Yeah, he's going to need to do more with it for sure. 
I would like to see what he can do standing up in this next round uh, because Germ German's a tough guy. It looks like he knows what he's doing on the ground, too. He's very calm I, right now in his corner. I would take my chances standing up with, with uh, German if, if I was rolling around with him and he was being that dominant with me. And German didn't want to touch touch gloves at the beginning of the, of this fight. Oh, big body kick by German right away. Oh, there he goes. There he got his takedown he talked about. And he ended up on top. Yeah. Now let's see what he does with it. They're against, they're German against the is not willing to accept bottom position, though. Oh, he no. kept moving the whole time. Yeah. But Arturo, with a sneaky back take, catching German on He's the rollout. He's a little low. German needs to start uh, start hipping out. Yeah, he's yeah. lost the position. No guard, pass. Drive the knee. Good drive now. Pass it out guard. He's got no guard. Now crucify him. Right, right through crucify Arturo's him. guard. Oh wow, and he just passed right back onto full right now. Great, great time to start ground and pound. Yeah. If I'm German right now, I'm sitting up and just pummeling. When he gets up on his side, find the daggy. If if German starts doing ground and pound, I feel like I, he's going to end up getting his back to avoid it, and he has a little bit more time to work that rear naked if he go. wants to. There we go. German postures up. Great oh, ground wow. and pound. See, he's right there, right to the, the back. right back onto the back. He's not in a comfortable position getting power half to move him back over to the mount, and he's going to start stomping on him again. Oh, and then some nice pass. punches are getting through. It's going to end. And, it's done. and there it is. And German is our winner. German from the shoot MMA with a uh, TKO in the second round. Great, great fight. Ladies and gentlemen, we have one more fight left this evening. Uh, make sure you stick with us to the end. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a referee stoppage at 126 of round two. And your winner from the red corner, Herman Tomoda. Wow. Great win. And that was a good stoppage too. There wasn't there wasn't nothing that was gonna save him after yeah, at that point. He no was covering question. up. He wasn't he he, he got top mount multiple times Ladies in this and fight. gentlemen, it is time to jump into our final fight.